Hello, my name is Xbyte, and today I'm going to be showing you a data pack that lets you use villagers to sell things for you. So, as promised, I'm back to doing uh, command videos on Saturday, and I think this week's uh, project is pretty good. It allows you to take a villager, like this, and have the trades right there be um, extracted from the chest. So essentially, uh, wh where you pay in right there is connected to this chest, and the thing you buy is connected to this chest right here. And if we look in here, we'll see there are 24 blocks of emerald. And if we look here, there's just one spruce sapling. So now, I place a block of emerald here, I try to buy it, and there we go. And now we're all sold out of saplings. We'll see the sapling is gone, and there are now 25 blocks of emerald. And if I were to, let, let's say, put three saplings in here, then I could go over here and buy three saplings before having it run out. And which chests uh, this villager is connected to is actually determined by the item in the item frame above it. So this one right here says buy, and this one right here says sell. And if I were to, for some reason it doesn't let me break item frames. Uh, so if I were to uh, get rid of these item frames right here, right here, then let's see, it, it, it's still set on, on, on what it was previously. But then if I were to put sell in here and buy in here, then we're now buying spruce saplings and selling these. And since we have like a whole bunch of them, I can now just pull it out. And there's like 20 something, I think. Yeah, I had like 25. So I'm just going to keep pulling them out until I run out. And there we go. Or we could just destroy these chests entirely. And then let's say we could put them over here and then put item frames on them. Put buy right here sell right here and let's say we want to buy a minecart uh, and that actually lets let's, let's just be buying uh, emeralds like normal and then we'll sell a minecart and now let's see if i believe that's close enough yeah there we go so now we pay in here we take out here and when we look over here we'll see that the money's been deposited and the minecart's been removed and there, there, there's nothing really special about these items. It could be really any item. It's, it's, it's all the, it's just the name that matters. It's like if I, if I break that, then I can go, I can like grab this lever, put it in here. Which one did I get rid of? I don't know. I'll, I'll just do cell. There we go. So now I have this as a cell, and I can just place a, another one over. Let's see here. Put the item frame on here, and then put cell. In there, so we now have buy and sell. We're buying those, and then let's sell iron chest plate. And then now we can buy the iron chest plate out of here. Now, this data pack is currently not ready to be released, as there are some glitches and ways of, like some problems that you'll, you'd encounter if you were to do it. For example, if I were to put two saplings in here, it doesn't really work with one, but if I were to have two in there and then if i were to put three in here and run really fast i could get three out of it and actually just duplicate a whole new item so i still need to get that fixed also there is currently no way to spawn in the villagers uh, i'm just using this command block right here so in a later version i will add in a way to spawn villagers and to customize them and have it look the way you want so if you are interested in this and would like to download it, then uh, you'll have to wait for my, a future video, probably my next one, which will talk about the new features once I've actually implemented them and will have a download link. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like, and if you want to see more, then subscribe and click the bell for a new video every Saturday and videos from my survival series every once in a while through the week. And I'll see you next time. Bye!